Corsair Raptor K40 keyboard and M45 mouse are designed to provide best-in-class features and performance for gaming. Click now to learn more. So Slick, Diesel, and I all geeked out hardcore over this thing at CES 2013. This is the ARM2 LCD Interactive ARM, which is probably the worst possible name for this thing. But basically it is Silverstone's dual LCD mount that clips to your desk and this achieves a couple of things. So number one is it takes the probably crappy stand that was built into your monitor and makes it awesome. So it adds things like uh, pivot as well as height adjust and move anywhere you want adjust. And number two is it helps save space on your desk because you don't have to have the stand actually down on your desk. Oh, okay, I guess I should show you the box. MIT apparently stands for Made in Taiwan. If the build quality of this is anything like the one we saw at CES, then apparently that's a big deal because it's friggin' awesome. Um, it's made of aluminum alloy as well as steel and pretty much works like this. So there's a piece here that allows you to clip it to your desk and oh man, it just, oh, I love the way this is built. So this piece right here, you can tell is made of steel because it's got a lot of weight to it. So this is what clips on the desk. And then there's another piece here that clips to this and then allows you to clamp it onto the desk. This is all extremely robust. That should tell you everything you need to know about it, that noise right there. Then the other pieces are made of aluminum. So this guy right here is the shaft that the two arm uh, arms uh, screw down onto. Screws in pretty deep, there you go. So that's nice and solid in there, nicely threaded, very lightweight. Then what you do is you take two of these and pretty much what these have are these like spring-loaded adjustable arms. So you can do whatever you want with them. You can rotate them, you can move them up, you can move them down, and you can sort of move them in every possible direction. Oh, these are such gorgeous aluminum too because they're extremely lightweight. There's plastic pieces in the bottom of them. And then other than that, these are just like beautiful single piece aluminum pieces here. So you just use hex screws in order to affix them at the height that you want. And the whole thing pretty much goes together like that. So it comes with an Allen key as well as all the hardware bits you'll need. Your monitors will need to be VESA mount compatible. So not all of them are but most of them pretty much are. There's some other little pieces here. So there's a little cable management piece that I evidently missed, but hopefully Diesel's installation video will be somewhat helpful for all of that. And I think that pretty much wraps it up. Other than that, I think we're just gonna fill this up with some glam footage. So let us know if you liked this video about Silverstone's ARM2 LCD interactive ARM. Basically, there the, the market for these aftermarket um, monitor stands has just been so stagnant for so long with not very much innovation. And I'm really happy to see a truly high quality solution. And it goes to show you how much we've been being swindled over the years when Silverstone can build this and bring it to market for a couple hundred dollars when you were probably paying a couple hundred dollars for something that wasn't built out of aluminum and doesn't have this kind of gorgeous industrial design. So yeah, they were taking an awful lot of margin on these products before. So kudos to Silverstone for addressing that and bringing something truly unique to the market. It holds up to two 24 inch monitors. I probably should have mentioned that before. And uh, don't forget to subscribe if you like this video. Don't forget to like this video if you liked the video or the product or both. And don't forget to leave a comment and let us know what would you do if you had a couple of, uh, if you had one or, oh man, you could even run like a couple of these and you could like put them on your desk and then you could have another one there. You could even run a triple monitor display off that. Position them exactly perfectly. Okay, we're done here.